Hi guys, I'm Kimchi. Welcome to my channel. Happy watching. After sewing an unto rents, they get going to the castle again. I have to rest on an at home and protect her. If friends at deep like that, it must be even worse for other beast men. Oh, so Rance was reluctant to part with An An. An An may become spurred to hide hell. Wow, a total An An. What if she turns into a second Rosa? Um, Bai has her point. It's a warning to have a daughter that's too beautiful. If she looked normal, there wouldn't be so much danger. <laughs> Curtis keeps yawning. He must be so sleepy. After walking a while, they finally arrive at the castle. We are here. The walls are so high. I built them during your postpartum. You won't ever catch a court bridge with this in the way. Let's go inside. And they all, including the cubs, get inside the castle. And Bai couldn't help but to be amazed. Wow! Hot yet is so rats. We can dig a fish pond of a dell and make some swings on the trees. Um, there's space to set up some grape vines too. Do you like this place? Yes, very much. There are five walls in the castle. All of them are yours. Though it's cold like now, so we'll stay on the first floor. I hope you like the interior decor. So Winston has prepared another surprise for Bye. He seems to put so much works in the decoration and we can see there is a bed in the bedroom and other furniture like in the human words this look looks a lot like my original room so Vincent decorated the castle according to Bai's word I arranged it like how you describe your home. Why is Ching Ching crying? Do you not like it? Should I rearrange these things? I do, it's amazing. I really like it, thank you. Why feel so touched and is very content with the decoration. No. You don't need to thank me. You just need to enjoy it. Oh, Winston. What a husband material. Okay. Oh, how sweet and romantic. Winston Ahem, <clears throat> we should start unpacking and Aunt is getting hungry And the night comes Bai is seen resting on her bed holding an Aunt She eats, she eats poops, poops and, and sleeps. 
she's enjoying her mother's role. And Anne is such a good kid. Oh, what a lovely motherly love. The room is really dark, so I don't know where Curtis went. I haven't seen him since we got here. He's a total psycho. I had to do everything. Curtis went to hibernate underground, so we'll have to step quieter for now. That's next way to Reggie. He probably wouldn't even wake up if we stomp the floor. Look, Ching Ching, the moon is so rush and bright tonight. It's a full moon. It's beautiful. We chose a good day to move. But suddenly, An An's face looks so uncomfortable. <laughs> huh? Did you poop again, or are you hungry? It's, it's the, the first, first time, time I've seen An An cry out so painfully. So I heard her cry. Is it time to change her diaper again? But it's completely dry. She might be hungry. Thinking you should feed her. I just breastfed her, though. How could that happen? And suddenly, an aunt throws up the milk. She just drank. <coughs> of course, they are shocked to see that. And Anne just threw up. Winston, get Harvey over. Without delaying any time, Winston rushes out and heading to Harvey Place. But on the way, he suddenly realized that it is a full moon. Next is the full moon. Could it be that I was poisoned by the scorpion venom after all? Will Anan be alright? 